welcome back guys to yet another new world video on this channel today we are going over a weapon experience farm now obviously we have made a couple different ones uh <laughs> of this style of videos like we've definitely made more than one when it comes to weapon experiences but it is because we i, I want to give you guys a couple different options when it comes to actually farming this weapon experience uh because obviously the different spots have have certain amounts of competition and then they become a little less valuable and a little less good so that's why it's uh, it's good to have a couple different options it's good to know that there's different options for what you can do now the one we are going to talk about today is going to be in monarch's bluffs and before we get into it obviously make sure that you guys drop a little bit of a like uh even as a sub on the channel i would greatly appreciate it um there we go all right but let's get into it we are actually going to be down here in dead man's cove now this is a elite zone is it's going to be an elite zone but it is only level 25 mobs um even though you're level 60 if you pull too many of these you are going to have a little bit of a hard time depending on the on the build that you're running so i would recommend probably bringing some you know a little bit of food or maybe even some some health potions just uh, if you're ever going to get into trouble if you're not paying full full attention after farming this for uh for hours and hours if you're if that's something you're gonna do but there is a, such a good density of mobs here it's basically going to be inside this entire cave but also out here so you can see i'll show you guys right right over here for example that you're going to be able to see how much these are going to give this is give you guys a little taste 102 so you can see all of these here like i don't know eight mobs so th this is this is a little problematic to pull these guys especially if you're if you're in the same build that i have you got to be a little careful because otherwise you can't actually die here because they do they do deal a little bit of damage as you can see right so we got to be a little careful maybe use a little health pot there but you guys can see it's hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of weapon mastery that we're going to be getting here it's 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 really just too good right it's too good it's i don't know if it's necessarily the best one because there is a limited amount of mobs here and sometimes there is a good amount of rep uh, or not reputation competition here but it is going to be a pretty good spot for farming weapon mastery as a little bonus if you're a fan of monarch's bluffs you are also going to be, be getting a quite a lot of territory standing i didn't actually uh, pay attention to this uh, starting off but you can see that we're getting you know 30 40 uh territory standing experience every time we kill one of these and that's quite a lot it's going to wreck up over time especially if you're gonna level a lot of weapons here or if you plan on just you know doing a couple levels you are still going to be getting a little bit of territory staying standing as well so you can think about that when you're out here and uh if you're into it obviously you can also get a little bit of star metal around this place as you can see right there and there are going to be a lot of chests around this place as well so you can get a couple provisions chests and those are good for cooking reagents and all sorts of other stuff so it is important to look around for you can see there's one right here that i already took and then you can see that there's going to be these ones as well but yeah, as I said, this is going to be a very, very good farm because you can see all around here, you can go down these rows here, kill all these mobs that are hanging out, and then you can go back into the cove again. It is going to be very good uh, because obviously building up the weapon mastery is something that we all want to do to be able to play all sorts of different playstyles in this game. And it, it does take forever to farm up the weapon mastery and that's why we have multiple videos of all sorts of locations to farm it because it is going to be very, very important to get it up because it will increase your damage a lot by getting your weapon mastery up so that is why we are making this video but i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope it helped you out i hope you are going to get on the spot um and yeah but that's going to be it for this video uh i will see you guys on the next one see you guys